hi guys welcome to my youtube channel if you're new here my name is miss Du, and uh please subscribe to this channel like this video and uh, if you have a suggestion or a comment leave it on the comment section if you return uh if you subscriber who is returning thank you so much for coming back please give this video a thumbs up and uh let's get started so on today's video i'm gonna be showing you on how you can create a profile on canada.ca which is the official canadian immigration website and uh, i guess it will be like a series of video where first of all we need to create a profile and then later on i'm gonna show you on how you can apply for a job through the website apply for the visa through the website and all the things that you need to know about this website i'm gonna be taking you step by step so let's jump into today's uh, video and uh, i'm gonna be showing you on how to create a profile because after all you need a profile before anything else so what you need to do is just type canada canada dot ca and then go to search and uh, this is what we see it's the government of canada and you can either choose uh, france or english so with us i'm gonna be choosing english and after you choose english this is what you get to see this is the official website of the government of canada and uh, for this we're gonna go to we're gonna scroll down and i'm gonna show you where we're gonna click next so here we're going to click on immigration and citizenship uh, click on that i'm using my phone so if you're using your uh, laptop it will be much better because you're gonna you you'll be able to see all this at a go but still uh even if you're using your phone it means like still you can be able to do this so uh after we uh, we we click on immigration and citizenship scroll down to sign in or create an account to apply online so we're gonna click there and uh we have some few some few things we need to check here so number one is option one is gck uh sign in with the gck user id and password we don't have that option two sign in partners no we're not looking like uh, for that so we're gonna go with uh, don't have an account so we're just going to click register yep uh, so after we click on register uh we're going to get some uh, register for ircc secure account uh, to access our immigration and citizenship online service you need to create a, a secure account your account lets uh, lets you start an application submit and pay for your application get messages related to your application check the status of your application and update your information so it's very important for anyone who is planning to go to canada to have a profile on canada.ca which is the official canadian website so after that uh there we have on uh, we have some information on how to register for an account and uh so we to register for gsa register ha, 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 we we, <laughs> we have to go to the last one so with this one with here we are going to uh to use the first one to use the first one and this is register with GCYK okay so we're gonna click there oh, wait it's taking some time to load in so for this one uh, after we click register with GCK our, our simple secure simple secure access uh, one username and one password so let me choose a username let me see any username let's say dual 2022 this is for the purpose of this video okay 
and uh, that username is I guess okay and then for the password I want to show you what I'm gonna uh, so guys I had to post for me to pull to key in my password and uh, after I I had my username which is the I have to note it down 2022 with my password because I'll need it after that so there's term and condition in return to for the government of Canada providing you the GCK you agree to abide by the GK terms and condition to use which include the privacy so for me I will accept that so after you create your username and uh, password uh, we have to to, to do it again uh, the username that is the one 2022 and continue so I've uh, killed in sorry for that so after you key in your username we're gonna create a password again so for this I'm gonna pause for me to create the password for the security purposes so after that uh, I have already created my username and password and the next stage or the next step is to create your recovery questions I guess this applies to many of the website uh, app bank accounts up you have to create like recovery question just in case you forget your password and your username so they say your answer must contain at least three characters and contain no special character for example hashtag at you you hint must contain at least three characters and may contain letters numbers and the following conditions uh punks punk <laughs> punctuation characters apostrophe commas dash period and uh, question marks so uh so here we're going to select our our question and we have some question what is what, what was my first pet's name where did i meet my significant other what was the last name of my childhood friend where did i go to my honeymoon so i guess i'm gonna choose uh what was the last name of my childhood best friend so because i cannot forget that so i'm gonna key in my my let's see my my answers yep so my memorable person Memorable person. Memorable person. Okay, let me first uh, key in this one because it's very important. My memorable person is um, who? <laughs> let me say J. And uh, the hint is my son. Okay. Uh, my memorable date. Uh, my memorable day is um second second uh, zero five five uh, so it's gonna be zero five zero five. So that's it. Zero five zero five twenty eight. Ah, okay. Okay, okay, okay. I get it. Sorry, sorry, sorry. So we're gonna start with the year that is twenty eighteen, and then we're gonna go to the date zero five. If it's the date, and then zero five the months. Okay. Memorable. Uh. So I guess you guys are gonna see most of my. <laughs> 
my some of my information but it's okay my memorable date hints that's a birthday a birthday and then what i'm gonna click is continue okay so after that we go to optional account recovery uh to recover your username and password you have an option to recover via email if you don't wish to provide an email address at this time you may skip this te step email can be added later uh we will use your email to confirm your email address recover your username and password notify your account changes a verification email will be sent to address to provide so for me here i'm gonna just um continue because um uh, they say they uh, they've said that uh, it's not a must you include the email address at this point but you can always come back and include it so i'm gonna uh, skip skip that huh? so after that is gc sign in app complete uh, please keep your username secure for more information on how your privacy is protected please refer to a privacy notice uh you have successfully uh created a gc key your username is 2222 so that's how you create a profile on canada.ca which is very simple i guess you've seen there's no much hassle and uh, after that we are good to go and on our next video i'm gonna be showing you on how uh on the uh, i guess we're gonna look at the checklist of canadian tourist visa because that's the question i've been getting a lot uh, from people and uh as i told you earlier these things you can do them by yourself but if you don't have the necessary documents or the all the required documents that's where an agent come in to facilitate you with the paperwork the agent do not do, do not have any power when it comes to issuing of the visa but they can help you with the paperwork uh which will ha give you like um uh, will give you a better percentage chance of getting the visa so that's it um and uh, thank you for watching this video till the end if you haven't given this video a thumbs up please do so right now if you haven't subscribed this is the best time to do so and uh, see you in my next one bye bye